Hi, this is Jerome Diamond from the Yellow Bird Project. Here's my uh, Hayden t-shirt. It's got these two cute little bears on it. You can get it from the yellowbirdproject.com. It's a pure charity, 100% goes to charity. And get shirts from your favorite artists. They draw them themselves. It's pretty sweet. Anyway, this is uh, how you play The Underdog by Spoon from Gaga 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 or The Five Gaz, however you want to call it, whatever weirds you out less. So um, anyway, the thing with this song is it's easy chords, but it's all in the rhythm, and there's all these tiny variations in places where, you know, there shouldn't be, but there is. And uh, so Britt Daniel's really good at doing that, getting the most out of simple chords. So the song starts on a G chord. You just... Uh, Dun, dun, dun. Then the horns start. So the rhythm is strum, mute. So dun, dun, dun. C, B minor, or you could just power chord it. So. Dun, 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 dun. D, fifth and seventh. That's a walk down, so it's G to F sharp minor to E minor. Picture yourself in the living room to A minor. Picture yourself in your living room. Your pipe and slip is set out for you. G chord. I know you think that it ain't too far. This is a B minor chord, but it's barred at the uh, seventh and ninth fret. Uh -huh. I hear the call of a lifetime ring. Now he does C chord. And the need to get under it. So from C, he just slides up to the third and fifth. Oh, you cut out the middle man. A minor. Get free from the middle man. To a B minor. So he goes to C chord. It's a C up here. It's um, eighth and tenth fret. You got no fear of the messenger. G, C. You got no, got no regard for the things. Now this part's tricky. You got no regard for the things that you won't understand. You got no regard for the D and the G B C. It's a quick little riff. No regard for the things that you don't understand. You got no fear of the underdog. C to B minor. D. That's why you will not survive. And this is the arguably trickiest part of the song. It's G, C, G, D, D, G, C, G, C. It's a weird timing. I don't know why he does it. So it's one, two, one, 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 one. I wanna forget how conviction fits. Hmm, but can I get out from under it? Can I get it out of me? Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. Then he goes to a C instead of back to an E, e minor. We can't all be wedding cake. We can't all be boiled away. A minor. I try, but I can't get go of it. He goes from a B minor to a B major. I can't let go of it, uh-huh. C. You got no fear of the underdog. I'm making up the words. You got no God for the things that you don't understand. You know we got for the messenger. That's why you will not survive. All right. That weird timing thing.
thing that I tell you now. Now he just does normal chords, E minor, A minor, D. It may not go over well, G. The way that I spell it out, photo up, the way that I spell it out. But you have fear of the underdog, G. Got no regard for the D and the G, B, C. No regard for the messenger. That's why you will not survive. All right. really all in the variations and the rhythm and god i hate them they're so good so um that's the underdog